now we will edit multiple pages at the same time so we can make some space and here in, on the page in action we have two options one is duplicate and one is duplicate and mirror so what they do is they create a different another view of the same page and mirror will also update the, the duplicated page with all the changes done to the parent page. So for example, if I, if I delete this button here, it's also deleted in this view. And this is very useful when we want to edit the page and at the same time observe um, how it looks on different screen sizes. Let's put this phone. So now when, when I when I change the content it, we immediately see what happens on different screen sizes. So that's one way of using multi-page editing. Another way to use multi-page editing is to open multiple files which share the same same style sheet. So here I have two pages and now like if I do a change and this, this page is done with, with variables so it's easy to change. So if I do a change here I can see how it looks on all the pages that use this style sheet. And then again another combination is to have the same page but with different style sheets. So now I'll go to Style Sheet Manager and I will duplicate the Style Sheet and select second page, New Manage, and I will detach the original Style Sheet and add the Style Sheet that we just duplicated. Now I can edit both style sheets and experiment with with different with different designs, different colors, different fonts to see what what works best. And I can also combine different different modes. And I can go, for example, this page in two sizes, but with different style sheets. And when I make any change, it still gets reflected on the other two pages, but they still look different because they use different style sheets.